can Disney get stopped? Like, is there any way to stop Disney at this point? I don't think so. I just don't think so. What is going on guys? I'm your host Freddy Dispo. Welcome back to Movie Stalkers and I just came back from a screening from Disney's Moana. I was pronouncing it Moana for the past few months but apparently it's Moana so my apologies but here's my review for Moana. I just came back from it and I'm going to give you my positives, my negatives, and my overall thoughts on the movie itself. Before we get down to my movie review I just want to say thank you to everybody who's been watching my Cars 3 teaser trailer reaction. Right now it's gotten over 200 views. Thank you so much to everybody who watched that. Thank you. It is very, very well appreciated. And yeah, really lo looking forward to Cars 3, actually. I'm, I'm kind of interested to see what it looks like and how, you know, the story is. So, um, But let's talk about Moana. So, like I said, positives, negatives, and overall thoughts on the actual film itself. And give you an overall score out of 10. So, let's first start off with the positives. The positives about this film is that the film off the bat is absolutely beautiful. This is a beautiful looking film. The visuals are absolutely amazing. They're off the charts. I swear at each Disney film they up the the quality of each of their films. I feel like each time the visuals just get better, better, and better. And Moana is a prime example of that. And the characters are absolutely great. I love Moana. I love Maui. And those are your two characters. You got Mo Moana who is played by, I forgot her name, but she is a new addition to the voice acting uh, people. She's a new addition. This is her, her acting debut. And uh, I gotta say, it was a pretty strong opening for her. Um, she did a fantastic job as, as a main lead. And really looking forward to her in more films. If she does more Disney films, thumbs up. I'm more of seeing that voice actor. But if she does uh, new some live action films, I'm really interested to see that as well. So uh, she did a really good job. I was really connected with her character throughout the entire movie. Uh, really enjoyed her, uh, just her attitude as well. She, she, you know, she's a Disney princess. I'll say that she's a Disney princess. But there's times where she's just, you know, she has heart. There's times where she's uh, like she can fight. She's a fighter. She's a hunt. She's not a hunter, but she's like a fighter. She has heart, and you know, you really care for her character throughout most of the movie. And that's something that's very rare in some cases in certain movies for me. You know, there's certain movies where I just can't connect with the characters. Case in point, Cars 2. Yes. I'm still saying that Cars 2 is probably one of the worst Pixar films ever. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. But Moana is a prime example of how the characters hook you. And she she did a really good job as a main lead. And I'm really looking forward to her in more movies. Uh, Dwayne The Rock Johnson plays uh, Maui, who was the other character in this movie, and he did a great job as well. You know, he's a he's a great uh, actor. He's done fantastic movies. He's a, a national treasure in the voice acting and acting, uh, you know, uh, community. And uh, he did a really good job. I really enjoyed his performance. At first, he starts off as a jerk type of character, and then once you learn more about his character, you really feel for him. You really understand his motives and you really understand like where he's coming from and why he's in this, you know, on this uh, journey with Moana. So I uh, really enjoyed also the chemistry between these two, the two characters, M Moana and Maui. Their chemistry was very, very good. I was really surprised by their chemistry. They blended very, very well together. And the whole movie rests on these two. There's nobody else. It's just these two characters. It's just... Moana and Maui, those are your two characters throughout the entire movie. It's like Wally. You got Wally and Eva. Those are your two characters. They with Moana, it's Moana and Maui. So it's just these two primary characters throughout the entire film. And I like that. I like that we're focused on just these two characters and nobody else. So that's a great positive for me. Um, the story flowed very, very nicely. I liked how in certain moments... It's uh, it's light, and then there's emotion, and there's suspense, and then there is 
uh, you know, lightheartedness. Like, it goes into a nice folded circle, and it just keeps going throughout the entire film, which is nice. And it has a great pace, and uh, it's just it's just really... I really like this movie. I really, really did enjoy this movie. Um, a lot of, lot of great things about this movie. Um, if I had to nitpick one thing about the movie, um, that is the beginning to me was a little, uh, it's a little bit off. I just didn't, I just wasn't fully into it. But then once, once you get in, once uh, it gets past the beginning a little bit, it starts going into its natural flow as all Disney films do. And, except Cars 2. Um, <laughs> But um, overall, guys, I mean, there's not there's not much negative about this film. I mean, it's I wouldn't say it's a near perfect film, but it's a really good film. It has a great pace, great characters, beautiful visuals. I mean, oh my god, the visuals are absolutely beautiful. Um, and I I really like this movie, guys. I mean, there's not much to say. Go watch this movie when you guys have the chance to. It's amazing. It's spectacular. And I will give Moana a 9 out of 10. It's a really good film. Fantastic voice acting. And just really enjoyed it. It might be my favorite animated film of the year. I have to still think about it. Because, you know, there are other films like Zootopia, Kubo with the Two Strings. I'll think about it. But this was a really, really great film. Again, 9 out of 10 for me. Go check this out when you guys have the chance. And that is pretty much it for this review. If you saw Moana, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And tell me, what is your favorite animated film of the year so far? And what do you guys think? Do you think Moana deserves a sequel? Or do you think it just should stay as one solid film? For me, I think it just stays as one film. But that's it for this review. Hope you guys enjoyed it. As always, this has been these videos. Bow out. See you next time. Peace.